Ah, uh, I get it. You had a long day at work. And the last thing you want to do is to put that love bit of energy you have inside of you on going to the gym. Or even worse, working on a side hustle. We've all been there. Tomorrow's a new day, you tell yourself before putting on your favorite series on Netflix. While you order some comfort food. Could life be better? You ask, as you go grab a cold one from the fridge. Tomorrow is a new day. You lie to yourself. Your evening just started, and life is good. But what if your life could be better? From the 21st of December and for a period of 90 days, your life can change forever and all it takes is for you to take action. ARC 90 is a 90 day window where you will face physical and mental challenges that will help you turn your life around forever. No excuses. And the best part, you can start whenever you want. This is not a one-time challenge that you need to start this day and that's it. There's no other day you can start. You can start whenever you want. For 90 days, you commit yourself and you start and you complete this challenge. You will commit 100% of yourself to turn your life around. It will help you create habits that will transform your life and that will stick with you forever. At the end, you will look at the progress you made and you won't recognize yourself. The challenge consists of seven very simple rules that are designed to help you improve your life once and for all. And I'll be 100% honest with you. This is not like any other challenge you've previously seen before. However, you will be recognizing some aspects from challenges here and there. I take the hardest part of the 75 hard, I take the softest part of 75 soft, I take parts of dopamine, detox, monk mode, bear mode, winter arc, you name it. All combined to create this unique challenge that will transform your life. And this is how you're gonna do that. First. You will get out of bed before 6 a.m. every single day. If you are as committed as you say you are, you will get out of bed before anyone else does to work on one goal of your own, whether it's hitting the gym before anyone else does it or working on a side hustle that you've been postponed to start. Waking up early will give you the extra time you need without distractions when you're fresh out of bed in order to get shit done. Oh, and make your bed. Whether it's straight after you wake up, whether it's after you wash your face, after you wash your teeth, after you have your coffee, I don't care, but you're gonna make your bed. And that's the first activity you conquer on the day. Second, you will not get distracted. That means no social media, no binge watching series for hours with no purpose, no video games, and most important, no porn. This doesn't mean you're not allowed to have fun, go out to the movies with your partner or hang out with your friends. It only means you will avoid unnecessary distractions, like social media for example. Because consuming unnecessary content is the only thing that is actually stopping you from committing your goals and achieving them. Do me a favor and check how many hours you use your phone on a day-to-day -day basis. By the end, you will increase this number by half. Does this mean that you are not allowed to create content and post it online? On the contrary, create every day something. Just don't consume. Don't spike the dopamine in your brain that gets you addicted to the platform. Third, you will work out at least 45 minutes every day. And I put emphasis on the at least. Every day you will go out and for 45 minutes or more, you will do any sport of your liking, whether it's a brisk walk with your dog, whether it's going for a run, whether it's boxing, rugby, basketball, or just weightlifting. Anything. Just do sports for at least 45 minutes every day. You will get your ass out of the couch, put on some sports clothes and move your body. You can follow any workout, any routine, any schedule, but just do it. Fourth, you will follow a diet, any. On top of that, no cheat meals, no alcohol, and you will drink at least two liters of water a day. You gotta stay hydrated. Straightforward, just follow a diet, any. Doesn't matter what type of diet you wanna follow, whether it's to lose weight, to win weight, anything. If you're bulking, if you're shredding, just follow a diet. Just choose a diet that complements your workout and daily activity and stick to it. Fifth, read 10 pages a day. 
you will start with a non-fiction book, any, doesn't matter which one. After you finish that non-fiction book, you will continue to read whatever other book you want, whether it's a love story, a romantic story, a fiction book, whatever. Just read 10 pages a day. The purpose is that you read, learn inspiring creativity, or even pick up some lessons from that self-improvement book that you always wanted to read. By the end, you will end up reading at least 90 pages, which should be around 3 or 4 books depending on the length. I'll leave a detailed list of books that I personally recommend down below. These are books that help me in my hardest moments and I hope you enjoy them if you're looking to read something in the self-improvement aspect. Sixth, reflect every day. Reflecting every day is probably the hardest but the most important activity of this challenge. Reflecting every day allows us to slow down, take a step back and appreciate how great of a world we live in. It allows us to learn about ourselves, how we feel, make immediate changes on a day-to-day -day basis. I've been reflecting every day on and off for approximately two years. Reflecting every day will has actually helped me to slow down and see how much progress I've made in the past two years. Sometimes we get carried away by our day-to-day -day and don't manage to look at all the progress we've made. Think about where you were one year ago, or even five, fuck it, ten years ago. See how much your life has changed, both for good and bad. Looking back and reflecting in the present help us in the present see how small our problems actually were in the past. You will reflect by meditating 15 minutes and journaling every single day. The journaling can be any type you want. Last, you will take a progress picture every day. Do with it whatever you want. Save it, post it, share it with a group of friends to, that are keeping you accountable. But just take a picture for you to look back and see how much you changed. Once this challenge is done, and if you are followed every single rule, you will see the effects on your body, your mind and your spirit. And I can guarantee you will feel better about yourself and the way you look. And if for whatever reason you break one of these rules, you need to start all over again. No excuses means no excuses. It's not going to be easy. No matter when you decide to start, whether it's winter or summer, spring or fall, there will always be an excuse not to commit, to break one rule, to skip one workout to drink one more beer, to stay in your comfort zone. If you decide to stay right where you are, you will make no progress. Earth keeps spinning without you. Life goes on. In three months from now, you will look at those who put on the effort, those who decided to get out of bed early and commit to a better life. And you will regret it. Because they are working their ass off to fulfill the dreams and yours too. They will be where you want it to be. But you can change that. You can become the person, fight for that life you want, and achieve your dreams. It won't happen in 90 days. But if you follow these very straightforward 7 rules, you will not regret it. Because you will be one step closer to where you want to be. And you will set yourself up for success. With habits that will transform you mentally, physically, and spiritually. And to help you get started, I created a free guide that you can download with a link down in the description. You have all the information you needed. Do you have what it takes to finish it? Close this video and go get the work done. Arc 90 is yours. You got this. We start 21st of December. See you then.